Seafood Boil Mukbang Part 2. I am so excited to have seafood again. I have been craving it. It's It's been a while. I think the last time I had seafood, or a seafood boil, was the time I shot that last video, the first one. It's been a while. I, I think I try to avoid it just because it kind of... I don't know, raises my blood pressure, all the seafood, the sauce that it's tossed in. It's insane. Very garlicky, spicy, crazy. But yeah, but this time around I got something else. I actually, um, well, I did get the shrimp and crawfish last time, but this time around I got some mussels. See you there. Can't really see. And I got some king crab legs. That is insane. Look at all that. Look at all that meat. Crazy. And right here I have a delicious cucumber vodka uh, ginger ale with some limes. Mmm. Refreshing. It actually is really good. You can get the cucumber vodka at Costco. I love Costco, you know that. First off, I want to go with the... Actually, I should drizzle some of the slime first. See, when you have a cut on your... My cuticles, or my hands are really dry. So the lime, I'm sure the sauce is gonna kick my ass later. I'm gonna regret it. But that's okay, because this is seafood. So do you see here? Got some mussels and this garlic Cajun sauce. Mmm. Guys. I love mussels. See that guy there? Wow. He's juicy. Delicious looking shrimp. This hit the spot. Suck the shit out of his head. some of that sauce in there. Wow. I totally forgot about him. I ripped his head off, but I didn't even eat him. Let's crack open the shell. Totally worth all the work. Mm. 
Wow. If you haven't noticed, I'm pretty intense when I peel. Shellfish. Poor guy. Pinch. Let's see, <sighs> muscle. Can you see that? Muscle up close. My mouth, my mouth's probably insane. The claw, I mean, it's not huge, but. Just a little, little bit of meat. I'll take it. Let's pinch. Dude, I got two and one. Amazing. Wow. Seriously. So I got this at Boiling Crab. I'm sure you guys have heard of it. Um, very popular restaurant. So I just want to explain real quick that this type of seafood boil is a very, I'm not sure if it's a California thing, but I know that a lot of people um, down south or, you know, in the East Coast, they're usually really confused as to why the boil is so saucy, but it's just the style of the restaurant. That doesn't necessarily mean that this is how it's normally served. Um, I, this is all, this is all I really know as far as it being served. So I don't, sometimes when I have it dry, I am not really that into it. So whatever. I mean, crawfish is crawfish. This is just all flavor. I love that lime. It really brings out the flavor. All right. I know you've been waiting for me to do, to dig into this crab claw. Let me take a sip first. I always say take a sip, but I take a lot of sips. <laughs> All right, let's see here. Let's start with the middle guy. Actually, let's start with the big guy. So you guys, real quick, all you guys are probably wondering how much this cost me. This was um, roughly 65 US dollars. Not too bad. Uh, the Crab legs were about $27 per pound. That's not too bad either. I don't know. 
Look, it looks incredible. It could probably freaking stab me. So, I'm gonna start with the top. Fucking break the shit out of that. As you can see here. All that meat. If I dig in there, that's freaking pure meat right there. Wow. I can see why that's so expensive. Whoa. Empty. I'm not wasting a cent. All right. <laughs> All right, so I'm going to use this. I asked the server what tool to use. He said, use scissors. Do not look at me and say, you don't know how to, you don't know what the hell you're doing. I asked. I asked. The, uh, the exoskeleton on the king crab is actually easy to cut through, so. Ready? <laughs> Let's see here. I think some crab flung into your mouth. Let's see here. Ready for this? Hell yeah. Oh my God. Crazy. Look at that. Playing with my food. You guys are over here spending a lot of money on lobster with crabs. Wow. Guys, crabs. Crabs easily win. Take it all out. Let's see here. Big old chunk of meat. Hell yeah. It's so good. So sweet. Light, airy, flaky. Destroyed them. Wow.
<clears throat> it's kind of spicy. It's making my <clears throat> nose kind of makes my nose run right now. Two thumbs up. So good. Sorry if you hear the TV, he's watching something downstairs. All right. Ultimate seafood carnage. Real quick, if you haven't ever had mussels, they're, to me, they're gonna taste like mushrooms. No. The closest thing I could think of is mushrooms. Sorry, a lot of slurping in this video. If you're not into that, sorry, but you can't, you can't move around that. It's pretty saucy. All right, let's get to this guy here. Damn. Yes. Oh my god, I need to, st okay. I had a glimpse of myself, I'm like, I'm ravenous. I don't know what the hell got into me. Mmm, 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 mmm. Refreshing. Perfect. So I'll tell you something. My seafood videos, they seem to be really popular. And by popular, I, I, I mean just views. However, just an observation. They also seem to get the most dislikes and they also seem to get the worst type of comments that any you youtuber can, can get 
I've been always trying to figure out why. There's nothing in here. I think that was the double mus double muscle I had er earlier. Oh, this guy's gone too. It's probably somewhere in here. Probably some. Sorry, I lost my train of thought. No, I was saying. The only reasonable thing I can think of is because the specific group of people that are looking for seafood mukbangs, maybe they're a certain group that, you know, that doesn't necessarily want to see me, you know, eat the food. Sometimes I think that's the case. They love seafood mukbangs, they just don't want to see me eat it. And it, a lot of the hate usually comes from guys. I don't know why. I don't know why you guys have such a problem with me. I've not done anything to you. Makes no sense. Most of, most of my viewers are women anyway. They're like 70%. The last time I checked. My seafood carcasses, carcass, carcasses, whatever. Saucy as hell. All right. Oh, and a lot of people have opinions of how strong, strong opinions of how you should eat seafood. You know, they're always saying, you're not doing it justice. You don't know what you're doing. Fine. Let's say if I didn't know what I was doing, at least I'm getting the damn meat out. That's all you want, right? It's going right in my mouth. It's not going anywhere else, babe. See, you pissed me off. I dropped the damn thing. Mmm. Yeah. God damn, I would be eating this all the damn time. All the time. All the time.
Wow. Changing my life. So <clears throat> JetBlue had a, I guess like at this two day sale, I booked two tickets, two separate tickets, two separate trips early next year. I am going to New York and I'm going to Seattle, Washington. Oh, I'm so excited. It was so cheap, so cheap. What the hell is that? And those, um, those who know Rachel, if you watch my friend Bong, you'll know who Rachel is. She, I didn't tell you, but she moved to Seattle, Washington. So that was partly the reason why I decided on Seattle because I missed that crazy girl and I want to see her. She's probably gonna kill me for telling you this, but a few weeks ago, she had the chicken pox. Yes, ma'am, the chicken pox. Poor freaking thing. I mean, whatever, we all went through it. But apparently her strain, the strain that she got when she was a child wasn't strong enough or whatever the case. So this time around, she got hella sick. Anyways, I'm gonna give her a big old kiss for you guys. Hi Rachel, I know you're watching. Love you. You're gonna hate me. Let me see a text message from you. Two huge guys here. Hmm. Mm -mm -mm. Messy. I guess I don't mind messy when it tastes good. Oh. 
Huh? Everything else is trash. So much fucking sauce. Last but not least, this big old guy. Actually, what I'm gonna do, Actually, it is pretty bad. Yeah, you definitely can't crack king crab because the, the skeleton is just really soft. It's like impossible. I found my dog hair in the freaking king crab. God, her dog hair is everywhere. chunk of meat there. Mm. Yes. That is the way top it all off and that's how it should look $75 not too bad I love you guys I will see you soon and uh, I hope you enjoyed a little bit of ASMR for you I guess just a little bit but I'll see you next time with more talking. Bye.